The Riley and Kimmy Show. Uh oh. <laughs> Are you ready? Kimmy's rolling. Are you ready? Uh, sure. Okay, here we go. Sure, I'm always ready. <laughs> you're you're ready? Sure. One. I guess we just roll them. Oh boy, I'm how'd you like that? I'm getting ready to have a French fry burp. Well, that is a great way to open up an interview. Holy moly! So they, it, they did you get it all out? You, did you try some of those? You're talking about the food that was oh, here at the Deland. There's some tasty little burgers. <laughs> Comic and collectible show, and heavily salted and peppered. And a lot the, of people and, don't get that with French fries. And then you brought me potted meat, and Butch signed. Yes. Butch was kind enough yeah. to sign my great value luncheon meat. Look at that. Butch Patrick signed your luncheon meat. He did. He did. And that's that's going to be part of my dowry when I meet that special girl someday. But there will be a prenup because ain't nobody ain't nobody get your meat. No, don't don't. Oh, see, and here we are, the Mr. Clean Show. What? I said touch your meat. Working blue over here. I said touch your meat. Now you're manhandling my meat. I sure am. I'd thank you to put my meat back on so the table I could belongs. I can now say I manhandled Space Ghost meat. That's that's right. All 340 grams of it. Yes, I did. And the girls and, at home work that out on and, your think and do activity computer. And get this, full of protein. Yes. <laughs> yes. When did, when did this show go down the tubes? When did this show become a dirty thing? Because of you. You're a no, bad influence. Don't blame me. You're a bad influence. Don't blame me. You've always worked blue. Bad influence of the right. You're not letting your fans know the no, truth. No, it's not true. You've always worked blue. Bad influence. By the way, what time you got to get the jacket back to Don Ho? You like it? Yeah. You want to? Actually, I do like it. Well, thank you. Tiny bubbles. It's like a puzzle. <laughs> it's like a puzzle jacket or something. You making fun of my jacket? No, I'm not. It's yes, a fine. No, no. You're making fun of my jacket. So what are we doing anyway? I don't know. But bring we're, this thing back to normal. What we're supposed to be doing is talking about the Orlando toy and comic. Out of hell with it. Let's go back to my meat. Okay, you don't want to talk about that? Yeah, are you sure? You don't want to talk about all 340 grams of it. There you go, girls. But you are the star at the Orlando Toy and Comic Con. Which, which is why I'm on the bottom left of oh, the wait, thing. Look at the thing. Yeah, there you go. Well, That's look where we are. Well, yeah, they weren't nice to you either. We're, we're a dot. <laughs> Who's, is this our friend Mike's responsible for this? Yes, Mike Priest of the Orlando at, Toy and Comic Con. At the Holiday Inn, no less, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> Ghostbusters 2, it might have been it might have been a room on the spaceship made to look like the Holiday Inn. You'll have a swimming pool, George Lowe. Oh, did I tell you you're in the, uh, you know, the, the, the little dunk tank? Oh, doing? no, no, we won't be doing yeah, that. It's the dunk tank. Oh, yeah. no, no. Yeah, that's between noon and one. Oh, no, there's, <laughs> there's a, a there are many reasons why that's not happening. The most <laughs> See, recent for my cardiologist. Oh, geez. Yeah, okay, a medical excuse that. of that one. Well, yeah. then it'll be the then paintball. That'll be known as the Orlando Lawsuit Ocon. Well, then we will have the paintball tournament with George as the target. Yep. We'll yeah, also, two, two as usual, we'll also have, as uh, I, I think Riley told me, they call them the big girls. Oh. It's kind of like the Shriners, only they, they ride around on those little go-kart things and tube tops, and we just wait for you know something to happen. Well, all kinds of fun at the Orlando Toy and Comic-Con. That, yeah. is, that is January 29th. It's, they used to call them the Jigglers. Okay. First one, they actually take bets with the audience. The first one to lose the tube top, you win a ham. So that's sort of like winning some meat? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Thanks for letting you know, me tactfully take one sip of water before you shove the yeah, stupid mic back. Well, it could have been nice to see the spit take. Jeez. <laughs> so will I you be do that. Will you be bringing your meat to the Orlando Toy and Comic Con? <sighs> Long time I've known them both. She's the normal one. He's the one. Yeah. Go go to your near your favorite nearest Asian restaurant. Just look for the year of the weirdo on the menu. I, the year I, you were born. With you, you weren't born in the snake year or the ox year or the cock year. You were born in the year of the weirdo. <laughs> yes, that's me. <laughs> my name's Riley. <laughs> now back back to the question. Back to the uh, question. Yeah. Are you bringing your meat? Yes, my meat will be there. Your meat will my, be at the Orlando Toy and Comic Con. My pungent, heavily salted 340 grams of meat will with high protein be waiting to visit you. And high protein. You see what he's doing over here? Can't you two? Hey, hey, focus. <laughs> We're supposed to focus. Who gave you two the day off? Well, see, he's now ignoring uh, us here because we 
maybe offended him. I don't know. Oh, you're fine. Oh, you, oh, no, you, I didn't you know if I offended him. Okay, I'm that's coming. good. I'll try. I'll try some more. <laughs> we'll see what happens. Orlando Toy and Comic Con. Go to OrlandoToyandComicCon.com to find out more. Tons of guests. George Lowe, the star, will be there. No, that's right. No, yes. I'm, I'm uh, way uh, down uh, here. Well, you, I'm and, not as important. And you know what? The guy who once drew a tentacle on the squid billies for one season. You're also with a TV, well not TV, but you're with an, another star who will be there. Is that my pal? What? No, it's going to be buddy? No, it's going to be Tug, the Bull Terrier, oh. Super Dog. Yeah. Yeah, gee, that's I'm looking forward to that. <laughs> and Tug will be there. I guarantee he's housebroken. Yeah, so so come see me and a dog. That's right, Tug the dog and Kimmy will be with us and have the brand new mascot for the Riley and Kimmy yeah. show making a debut right there, there you at, go. The, at the Orlando Toy and Comic Con. Kimmy's looking like yeah, I could have married that surgeon in college. Here's here's the way that went. Just think, Kimmy, it, it, it could have been this. The guy it it could have been this one. About Kimmy. 13 people a day. He's making a mint. Nope. Had to marry Puzzle Jacket Boy. <laughs> That's me. Came on down. I'm a conundrum. Drew the short straw. Got a Puzzle Jacket Boy. That's me. Happily married. That's me. Living under the power lines out of the Bidawee Trailer Park. Please join us at the Orlando Toy and Comic Con. George will be bringing his meat. <laughs> Meet Please his be meet. The ninth person to come and visit, won't you? Yeah, we're shooting for ten. Meet his meet at his table what at is the it Orlando. You, will you just quit pawing my meat? Well, okay, I'll, what I'll is just it with you. Well, it's generic meat. I like generic meat. Wait a minute, it's what is it? Great value meat. This, this boy had a chromosome take a way, way wide shortcut. All right. Well, through Groveland. Do you think the show promoter is going to like this video? I don't know. It's, Do we really probably, care? You're probably upsetting people. Do we really care? My guess is if the man is paying you in some capacity, this is going to get on his nerves. That's good. You think? I think so. Well, you know, just whatever you do, come and spend lots with me because I have bills you wouldn't believe. <laughs> I haven't even made the car payment yet. Uh -oh. We need no. to work on No, are you serious? Today. Oh, no, no, I, do I need to bring more meat you for you. You need to bring more meat. <laughs> I'll bring you some more meat. A case of meat next. And when when you come to the Orlando Toy and Comic Con, bring cans of food. That's good. Uh, he'll yeah, take it. Ten, 10 of these, we'd have over 3,000 grams of my meat. Mm -mm -mm. So bring some meat for George, and George will show you his meat at the Orlando Toy and Comic Con. Check out the website, orlandotoyandcomiccon.com. Visit rileyandkimmy.com for more details. We'll see you January 29th. And you can find out where he is, by the way, the day before a special event in Orlando. You can find that on our Facebook page.